Alright, hey YouTube, what's going on? Commander Galore here, and today I'm going to be showing you this little invention I made. I actually saw this part on YouTube, but I implemented something into the very last of it, so I'm going to sh just uh, show you how it works. It's basically an elevator. It works really nice. Um, most elevators in Minecraft in the past have been really inefficient or glitchy, but this one works pretty well because of the new slime block mechanics. So yeah, so the part that I implemented is basically the stopping mechanism. So let me show you how it works, like that. And right here you could just put like a, a chute or something to put you in some water or slime block just to get you back down. Um, that's totally up to you, but it works really well. So I'm gonna show you how to build it. So let's get started. Alright guys, so if you're about to follow this tutorial and watch me do this, and please give the video a like and subscribe, please. It would help me out so much because this video is a lot of effort, but it's totally up to you. So let's get started. Um, basically wherever you're going to start your elevator, let's put a sticky piston right there with a slime block on top. And you're going to want to put like stairs going up into it on top of the slime block. And then you're going to put a obsidian redstone dust obsidian with a button on top and you don't need that button anymore so you can just get rid of that and put some string in your inventory for later so once you have the button that basically starts the machine and so this is probably the there's two really hard things to remember about the system once you understand these two things you'll probably remember how to build it forever so basically you just have to remember that it goes three blocks in between the slime block and the sticky piston. So once you have that sticky piston, you're going to put one off to the side like that with the slime block in the middle, obsidian block above the sticky piston with redstone dust on top, obsidian block above that with a tripwire hook going into some string with another tripwire hook but you can't put that off to the side yet so you have to put it on the wall and put a block off to the side right there with the redstone dust sticky piston off to the side with a block of redstone and diagonally put a another block of obsidian below the redstone and put a repeater on top with redstone dust right there into a torch so once you have that that's the basic mechanism right there so let me show you how that works works pretty well and now once you have this done this is the second hardest part to remember you just have to skip a block right here and put your next set or like this is one layer of the contraption and this will be the second layer starting up here so you just skip a block in between the tripwire hook and the sticky piston so once you have that you're just going to copy what I did before so I'm just going to do it one more time if you didn't get it the first time. Slime block, obsidian, redstone, obsidian, tripwire, string, block, tripwire, block. Gosh, my bad guys. I'm sure my phone was buzzing the whole time. That's my fault. Um, redstone, dust, sticky piston block and diagonally another obsidian block with a repeater redstone dust and a torch so once you have that that basically will set you up for the rest if you want to keep going higher you just skip a block and put a sticky piston above it like that so yeah all right now I'm going to show you guys the part that I built which you, this part does not have to be obsidian so you can get rid of that. Haha, <laughs> that was kind of cool. That was pretty cool. Did not even mean to do that. All right, moving on. So wherever your last floor is going to be, you're going to put two blocks and just kind of copy um, a tripwire hook thing above it. So like that. And then you're going to put redstone dust above that, block on top, block on top, block, block, and block. Um, so once you have that, you're going to put a redstone torch above that with redstone dust above that and 
two sticky pistons off to the side and that's pretty much it so once you have that you can just fill in the wall right here and then this will be your floor right here so once you have that it should work pretty well basically what this does is it turns it off right when you hit it and right when you move it basically pushes you out so let me show that to you yeah so it works pretty well and like I said you can make a shoot that drops you down and puts you right back so it works pretty well you can um, put obsidian and iron or whatever you want to put around it wood to make it look all nice but remember that anything that'll touch a slime block has to be obsidian or this will not work so just be careful that you skip a block or two when putting these stuff around it because the slime block will try to for instance take the iron block with it so that could potentially mess it up so if you guys enjoyed the video please like comment subscribe helps me out a lot um share the video do all that jive and i'll be sticking to my schedule making more videos and so yeah so thanks for watching guys see ya